Okay, looks like I'm live. Let me get over to YouTube so I can see things the way everybody else will see them. Come on, computer, do your thing. Come on, computer. Okay. Hey, Leah. Hi, Danielle. How are you ladies doing tonight? Sherry, how are you? Welcome. Roseanne, how's it going? Hope everybody's having a great start to their weekend that you got, you know, relaxation or stuff done, whatever you needed to do. Adria, how you doing? Everybody's saying hello. Well, I hope you had a great week and that it's been a good weekend. I have been ironing and ironing and ironing and ironing and then some more ironing. I had a lot piled up to iron. But I beat it. I beat it about 4 o'clock this morning. So we're just usually the first couple of minutes, you know, 10 to 15 minutes. We just chit chat a little bit and we hang out and we wait to see who's coming in and then we get started. I'm going to make it as quick as possible, but I will tell you there are quite a few items <laughs> where the sale. Hopefully we can just truck right through it. I'll try to make it as painless as possible. Anybody do anything fun for the weekend? Any crafty projects? So I have tea, a little bit of coffee, uh, orange and pink. Francis, how you doing? The orange is a coral orange. Let me see if I can get something up here. What can I put up here? This not gonna be crazy so let's get a sample of some pink and a sample of some coral so this is our pink color and this is our coral color and we do have some lag tonight Some of the pieces are a little bit darker than this on both accounts, but uh, those are our two colors. Um, and then I have, you know, some other things. <laughs> we always have a little bit of tea or coffee or both. We've got uh, this fun set here. I'm doing great. Continuing Ed this weekend. Learn how to use the patterns we did as babies to restore. Nice. Well, that sounds like a lot of fun, Adria. Are you enjoying it so far? <laughs> Miss Francis, how you doing, lovely lady? Hope you're feeling all right. And you're doing, you know, all the things in life are going okay. <laughs>
doing good. Good. I'm glad to hear it. I am doing fine, but I am exhausted, I have to tell you. After the sale, I'm going to pile everything neatly in the corner, and I'm going to flop on the bed. I'm terrible at four, six-month-old baby. But I got before and after. <laughs> there you go. It sounds like you're at least having fun with it. That's good. Excuse me. So, yeah, we're just waiting for a few minutes. We'll give everybody a few minutes to get here. Oh, I see some of you have thumbed up already. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Thumbed up. Thumbs. <laughs> oh, boy. Hey, Maury. How you doing? Welcome. Usually my sale is tomorrow. <laughs> I usually do uh, every other Sunday. Uh but uh, Al's a sale, it falls on the 7th, which happens to be on Sunday. And generally, we don't both have a sale in the same day. That's a lot of sale. <laughs> um, so she'll be having hers tomorrow. I don't know what time she did. I asked her, but she didn't tell me. Um, she may not know yet. Sometimes she just wings it. But her sale was prepared yesterday. And I was working on mine till the last minute. <laughs> But and then I had to say to myself, when am I ever not working on it till the last minute? Oh, 4.30, there you go. I was shooting for 4.30, but I wasn't quite done writing things down. <laughs> and welcome to uh, Bima from the other room. She's in the other room. If the door was open, I could yell at her, but it's not open. Buggy's here for the weekend. Uh, he's doing buggy things. He wasn't feeling so good last night. He had an upset tummy. Mousy Deb, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. How's those videos going out there, Els? You doing good? She's, she's, I think she's in November or December. It's just crazy. I couldn't keep track of it all if I were that far ahead. I'd be like, I made what? <laughs> Thank you, Mari. Seven done finishing number eight after your sale. Hey, Sandy, how you doing? Hey, Sandy's in the other other room. <laughs> oh, I heard Adria was making you yummy papers. I heard it from you, but you know. <laughs> we'll give it three, four more minutes, and then we're just going to dive right in and plow through this. If uh, desired, we can recap at the end. Um, but it's not necessary if nobody, you know, if people don't come in late or you've had your... Could have buggy got here. You have to out to the garage because I don't, you know, the living room's his face when he's here. So I moved out to the garage. And uh, it was cold out there. It was cold. I had to put on a sweater <laughs> after it got late. After midnight, it was sweater time. But I, I beat the ironing board. I win. In a battle of the wheels, I won. I only got burnt once. It was windy. It was just whipping. It sounds like the house is haunted if you're in the garage when it's windy. <laughs> I'm all out there ironing paper like this. This is some haunted bullshit. <laughs> unexpectedly cold. I think that's how we're feeling. And it rained a little tiny bit, I think, yesterday. 
I'm glad you're very good, Roseanne. Awesome. Love it. All right. We got three more minutes and then we're starting. We're going to do it. Woohoo. Is that Cookie Monster she's yelling? You were just a monster head. She was loving on that paper. I had to give it over. I'm like, ooh, you, that's for you. So I'm glad she's getting more. And I'm glad you're getting a little bit something too. <laughs> Oh, you know what we can do real quick? I got a happy mail from Jacqueline over at Lovely's Crafting Lodge. Which was unexpected, but it was quite lovely. <laughs> Let me grab it real quick and I'll show it to you while we're waiting. All right, it's, it's, a, it's a cute little package. I will say, I got an email or I haven't emailed her yet. Um, I will say it came just like this, open like this. So I don't know if anything came out, but it was packed, you know, pretty tight. So hopefully it didn't, uh, it did not come open. I'm only concerned it came open because there was no note inside. Most people include a note, but not everybody. So who knows? <laughs> which I'm going to tea dye because they're awesome tastic. I've had these before. These are actually hard to find the vintage ones, but uh, yeah. She sent me like, wow. <laughs> I got, I got a uh, here one from freezer pops here. And I'm not sure what this one is. Reduce for additional value. Slightly blemished, undersized, or misshapen. I'm going to guess that's fruit. <laughs> and then uh, she sent me this one, too. Oh, so there's one of these. This kind with the... And then there's one of these. So I got all kinds of the... Like It's like the score on mesh. <laughs> all right, let me get, grab those up. Oh, my God. Yesterday, I was with my mom at doctor appointment and she has the Norwalk virus. Oh, that's, I've never heard of it either. I'll have to look that up after the live. Okay. And then she sent me two little bags of goodies also, which I was super excited about. It's always a challenge to get these open, isn't it? I feel like it's a case of maybe odds be ever in your favor. So she did set me a tarot card and then look at, I've never seen these ones this big. This is cool, but she did. Uh, I have a, I have, see, I'll do it real quick over here. I dyed some, I just haven't finished the process yet. I haven't finished dyeing all of them. I did some and some coffee a while back and they've been living on my desk, but look at what she did. Like there's a blue one with some purple on it. Is that not cool? So these are the ones I did, which will eventually I'll get, I'll have the rest of them done up. And, uh, but yeah, I've never seen these really big ones. I wonder if they're vintage. They're very cool. So there's that. And then she sent me, uh, some sewn around edges, tie dyed, uh, library cards. That's very cool. Uh, love the idea there. I, and I think, I don't know if that's a sewing machine or if it's hand sewn. I, I don't, I don't honestly know. She sent me some little scraps, which will get used up. There's some little mushrooms and so now I got mushroom paper to go with the mushroom paper that, uh, Adria sent me a couple of little, uh, look at, she, it's a, like a leafy pattern on the bags. And then there's a tie, a tie dye kind of one. And there's some stitching at the bottom here, which is very cool. And then this is a uh, mixed media. It looks like maybe stencil and then it's sewn around. So how cool is that? I got a couple of these, which I don't know if those are book images or if it's, a, it's a, maybe it's a block stamp. And then look, check these out. 
I think that might be a stencil, but that's cool too. Got a little, uh, it's like a peachy uh, library card, a postal thing with some trees. Uh, note paper, and look at that. <laughs> And a couple of tickies. I was happy with just the the mesh and the. <laughs> I'm not going to try to stuff it all in the envelope in this second. Let me get the big envelope and I'll put it in there so that I don't lose anything. Because later I'll be like, where did the thing go? I'm sorry that your mom has what amounts to the winter flu in the spring, but I've never actually heard of it. I wonder if it's new or old. Well, we will send her healing energy and, and, you know. And then this is the last part of it. So she sent me uh, Ohio Buckeye ice cream uh, cutout. And then she sent me... Uh, so she sent me three of these little Pocky envelopes. And they're sewn. And I think they're on avocado dyed paper. Um, so there's one two, three pockets. And then I guess if you didn't uh, glue it all the way down, you could have a, an extra, so four total if you wanted to. Uh, all sewn. And then, uh, so this third one, and she loaded this one with uh, some tarot cards and uh, there's a sunflower or uh, mother of wands. Yeah. So some uh, tarot cards. I thought they might be oracle cards, but she said, oh, the tower. Oof. Okay. <laughs> Temperance, okay. So, how cool is that? And I think this buckeye might have been tucked in there too. So that was my happy mail that I got a couple of days ago. I got to shoot her a quick message. I'm so bad about that. What I do with the bag? Let me tuck those in there too. I don't lose any of the pieces and parts. She said she was the second person, so. Oh, boy. Okay, so let me write that down. Because we seem to get everything that comes around. Norwalk virus. Okay. So I'll look that up later. Are you guys ready to start? Oh, no, Roseanne. I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, Bay a Sick Baby is no fun. And then Mommy, too. Oof. Okay. So, extra healing energy for them, and I will keep them in my thoughts. And uh, I do a little healing work every day, so I will, I will light the candle for them for sure. Aw. Aw. Well, we will work on that for sure. We don't we don't want anybody getting sick and or sicker, you know. We'll wish for speedy recoveries and, and good positive uh, healing energy. All right, so we're gonna start. I'm gonna be popping around a little bit because I've got some things out of order, but we're gonna start with uh now, I'm having individual pieces of the larger sizes. I did not have time to go through all the smaller pieces. So, um, there's no, uh, except for uh, this one, this uh, cheesecloth. I have one of those left. And that made it into the sale. But all the small pieces from this um, um, have not been included. Well, maybe a few. I think there's a little bit of this in there. But none of the envelopes and other stuff. Um, I did not have time to count those today. So uh, they'll be in the next sale, or I'll make a small pack for that. Um, so we're going to start here. Um, so this uh, pink pack is uh, 101 pieces. And the orange pack here is um, 73 pieces. Um, so Patreon's got uh, these. And uh, a little bit of apple green, which I uh, I have a little bit of that as a giveaway at the end. Um, 
So in the 73, I, I don't want to unpack it, but you guys are familiar with most of the paper. So in here, uh, in the pink pack is a letter size file folder. The 10 sheets of the 20 pound dot matrix, 15 of the 24 pound uh, regular paper that we do, 10 line notebook, five of the 67 pound cardstock, five of these, uh, this is a uh, calendar blotter pages. It's a single sheet and it's blank on the back um, and some lines on it here. And then it's got a, it's a perpetual calendar kind of thing where you circle the month and the day uh, if you were using it that way. it's it, There are uh, three different, four different kinds. There's, oh, this one is eight, pa eight pieces. Um, and then there is another uh, black and white piece. It's a signature page. And we'll see that later in the sale. There's five of those. Um, there is uh, five signature sheets from a composition book, a uh, wide rule. Five sheets of 9 by 12 sandwich wrap. One large lunch sack, which is right here. Uh, three library catalog cards, which are in the front. Oh, they're around here somewhere. Oh, they're over here. They're hiding over here. Uh, three mini coin envelopes. They're inside here, too. With the um, These are pieces off an invitation. I put in three pieces, three different sizes. Um, it's got a swirly pattern on it. Um, let's see, uh, large invitation envelopes, which are back here. Um, a couple of flat sacks, which I think right here, uh, mini doilies and mini cupcake, uh, pieces and, uh, some 11 by 17 ledger size paper in the orange, the 73 pieces, uh, we have uh, oops, a one letter size file folder, five sheets of the 11 by 17 ledger paper, 15 of the 24 pound, 10 dot matrix, five, a 67 pound cardstock, five pieces of newsprint, five pieces, 12, nine by 12 sandwich wrap, three pieces of embossed placemats, which are uh, back in here. I don't think, yeah, right here. It's this piece right here. Uh, there is, oh, that wasn't in, that was only for Patreon, so let me cross that off the list. There are some coffee filters, some small business envelopes, some number six envelopes, which is up, what's up here, some library checkout cards, and a large booklet-sized envelope, which I think are over here, back here. One six by nine envelope, and, uh... Five pieces of newsprint that is graph paper, which will also be in the mix. So um, these are the combo packs, and I only have one of each. Um, so we're going to put them in uh, pink first and then coral. And uh, they're, uh, the the 101 piece one is $24.50. The 73 piece one is $21.50. So uh, we'll start with the pink. Um, only one of each of these, and then we're going to get, we'll do the individual pieces after the tea dyed stuff. Never fear. We'll get to it all. So 101. Oh, shoot. I need another keyboard. Stupid keyboard. This pink. Uh, I'm going to have pink. 24.50. All right. Um, so everything that's in here um, will be in the sale except for uh, these smaller pieces. So and you can put pass if you guys aren't interested, Bull. Roseanne, you'd like the pink one? Okay. And then the 73 piece coral. It's $21.50. And the go is coming your way on that one. All right, I got you, Roseanne. All right. And.
Hey, Jacqueline, I just showed your happy mail. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome. No takers on the on the coral? No worries. All right, our next thing is uh, this piece of cheesecloth. It's uh, going to be 75 cents. I'm not going to fold it all the way out because it'll get weird. But this folds out, uh, I think... Oh, it's so the way we cut it, it's going to pull into uh, two different pieces. But this is the cheesecloth, uh, not the food grade. Um, it's the one that you like at the dollar store or Walmart. Um, so this one piece, uh, it's, it's actually two pieces, I guess. I don't know if it's cut on this end. Hold on. Nope, it's still attached at this end. I'm trying to tell if this is... Uh, two wide or one wide so um we'll actually make it 50 cents i thought it uh we i mean we must not cut it correctly oh janice you would like the coral perfect and welcome janice how are you better like that well you get here when you're meant to get here absolutely no worries <laughs> Um, I did want you to let you know, I don't think there was anything missing, but um, just in case, um, this came open like this, and it was stuffed pretty full. I don't think anything fell out. So, uh, just so you know, I think maybe because uh, it, the, the tape was here, I don't know. Anyway, just so you know. <laughs> And Christine is here too. Did I mean, hey, Christine. All you lovely ladies in here. Thank you so much. Okay. So 50 cents for the piece of uh, uh, pink. I dyed it myself. Cheesecloth. Uh, and the go is coming your way. Um, this was an experiment. We put it in the packs this time. But uh, we may be seeing more of this coming up. It, it actually turned out pretty well, I think. So, all right. Let's... Roseanne, you would like that? Perfect. Okay. And then we're going to flip to the front. Oops, too far. Too far. Okay. So, oops. Sorry. Here we go. We're in the right place. And our first item is actually these. I have eight of them available. If you guys are familiar with the coffee filters, we have uh, we we took them out of their their packs because maybe everybody doesn't need twenty, and put them into color groupings. This one is called Winter Delights. Um, I think we called it uh oh we called it something else in the pack. This was the Happy Meal, the Hags Happy Meal for uh, this month. <laughs> um, so there is purple, gray, or lavender. I'm sorry, it's lavender with sparkle. The lavender and the gray may or may not have sparkle, depending, because we had two different kinds. So um, once the sparkle goes away, it'll probably just be plain. So there's lavender gray, Bemis blue. Um, oy. hold on. I've got it written down over here. <laughs> uh, blue. So we've got lavender with sparkle, uh, tentative dawn, gray with sparkle, light olive, and Bemis blue. So lavender. Gray, Tentative Dawn, The Light Olive, I'm, I'm confusing myself, and Bemis Blue. One, two, three, four. Tentative Dawn. Gray with Sparkle. So those are the colors. It's gray with sparkle, Bemis blue, tentative dawn, light olive. Um, 
some of them, uh, some of them, it's a lot fainter than this. Um, and lavender. So lavender, light green, light olive green, tentative dawn beam is blue, and gray with sparkle are the five colors in there. Looks like little violets in here. <laughs> So, and, uh, sorry, uh, those are $2. I have eight packs of them. I'm not going to, oh, they're kind of buried in here. Here we go. So there we go. Uh, lavender, gray, tentative dawn, Bemis blue, light olive. Okay. <laughs> so there they are. Um, so let me go ahead and put that in. So it's um, five of each color. So it's a 25 pack. So you're not stuck with a whole bunch of one, but you have things that will work well together. These will work with any of our winter colors we've put out. Uh, quite a few of our fall colors and um, even some of the spring and summer, depending. Hey, Miss Allie, how you doing? So this is a 25 pack uh, coffee filters five and five so it's five colors five of each one it is uh two dollars and the go is coming your way okay so i have uh i have christine Danielle, Roseanne, Sandra, okay, so there are one, two, three, four left if anybody decides they need to have one. All right, let's get the next item up here. Okay, so this is a little out of order, I have to tell you, but I did a new experiment. So we have all of our solid color papers, but at the very end, and this is what part of what I was ironing last night, I took some tea dyed paper, some very light tea dyed paper, and I dip dyed it in the in the coral. You think I miss people. I got Christine, Danielle, Roseanne. Oh, I did miss Leah. Okay. Sorry. Uh, Leah. Sorry about that. Leah B. I got Sandra. All right. I'm going to read the, a new experiment pretty <laughs> I'm going to read the list. If your name's not on it, let me know. Christine, Danielle, Roseanne, Sandra, and Leah. Is that everybody? Speak up if I did not call your name and you wanted one. Francis, okay. Thank you. Awesome. So, uh, in the same view at, vein as Frankie, which is coming up, um, we're going to do that shortly after I finish the rainbow. I have three colors of the Gothic rainbow done. Very exciting. There's a weird lady in a coral colored shirt. I'm showing twerking her, twerking her ass off over here. I'm showing my support. One day I'm going to have the camera ready and you're going to open that door and your ass is going to be all woohoo and everybody's going to see it. Okay. So, um, I called this, what would you call this? What we call it? Paper. I'm going to slap you in the face. No, you're not. You're right, because I'd have to get up for that. I know. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm effing tired. I'm here in the safe so. No flossing today? We're not getting any flossing? Not any flossing. What? What? I don't know. It needs a name. I just, I didn't go there. I thought about pumpkin spice, but it's not really. Let me see it. Oh, my God. I showed it to you 85 times. Cherry dip. It's not. It's orange. It looks like a cherry dip at, at Dairy Queen. Creamsicle. 
that looks like the cherry dip at, at Dairy Queen. We'll call it creamsicle. Fine. Sc 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 scuttle, skittle, something. <laughs> no, I don't need the sound effects is too much. No. No. La, 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 la. Everybody says, hi, Elle. Hi, ladies. I helped my mom with some housework today, feeling kind of crispy. <laughs> Sore and crispy. <laughs> if only you could see. Why? 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 To keep you awake and on your toes. Was I falling asleep? I don't know. Maybe you were. Okay. So this is $3 a pack. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, we'll go since I said it. Since it came out of my mouth like that. $3 a pack. Oh my god, no! <laughs> Why? Why would you twerk right in front of me? You're gonna get your butt cheeks flapping? I love you. Sound effects. My brain is broken. So we're gonna do creamsicle paper. Oh my god. These are uh, 10 packs for $3. Oh my god. Uh, three. I'm sure I've missed milk creamsicle. Don't make fun of me. All right. So there are um, eight of those available. And now Elle's twerking in an orange creamsicle shirt is indelibly, indelibly imprinted on my brain. I will never be able to unsee that, people. Okay. So I have Danielle. You need something to go with your other quirl, so Janice will take one. Peggy, Peggy, how you doing? Rebecca. Krabby's in the house. Look at all you lurkers coming out. Of course, Mike doesn't complain when you twerk. He likes everything to jiggle on you and it for it to be in his face. He would like a lap dance any day. And Roseanne. All right, I'm going to call it out again. If you are said me and uh, I don't say your name, let me know. Danielle, Janice, Peggy, Rebecca, Roseanne. That's what I got. And there are three left if anybody decides they got to have the creamsicle. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to move on. <laughs> My brain is broken. My brain is broken. And it's all Elsa's fault. Okay, so we haven't had these in a short while, a long while. It's been a while. These are the half sheet scrap packs. These are the leftovers from printing up labels. So I tea dye them. And I keep a pack for myself every time. Got a few grungy ones in here. Um, but I use them to for pages and small books. Um, I use them to line things. I use them to doodle on. Um, I have two packs of that available. Um, I don't give a size because there, and there is variations. Labels printed up at Etsy and Pirate Ship and off of, uh, 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 I can do PayPal. All are slightly different sizes. So there are some variations. And I think that this one has a piece of cardstock in it. So a uh, half sheet, 25 pack, uh, 24 pound half sheet. Well, it's not. It's a mix. There could be 20, 24, and or cardstock. We use all of those on the printer. So 25 pack, half sheet, scrap pack. And that is uh, 250 and there are two available. Oh, no, I'm not making it 50 bucks. Jeez, Louise. And the go is coming your way. Danielle would like one of those. 
and Peggy for the win. Thank you, ladies. Okay. Now, I have something very similar, but I have to flip pages for a second. Hold on. This is where I got stuff out of order. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm looking for the half sheet. That's orange. Hold, please. And my handwriting sucks. Uh. Oh, honestly. Oh, I wrote it in here. Print marble people, a variety print rifle paint, piece cardstock. Oh, no, there are four of them. Okay, well, I'll just wait on that until we find it. Darn it. Okay, so next up is a five-pack. Oh, we need to move these. I'm sorry. A five-pack of these invitation envelopes, and these are 6.25 by 5.25. So when it's folded like that, these are a nice... Uh, I wanted to make sure that wasn't schmutz. <laughs> These are a nice uh, medium to dark, a little bit of grunge. Now uh, this side, some markings from the dyeing racks. I have to dye them this way face down. Otherwise they puff up and they're <laughs> hard to iron. Um, so this is, uh, I only have one of these. It's a five pack of these invitation envelopes and it's 75 cents. So, uh Five pack large invitation envelopes, uh, 75 cents, and there is your go. Okay. And Danielle will take that. Thank you. All right, next up, these are uh, blank cards. It folds like this. Uh, it is uh, pretty heavy. I don't know if it's 110, but it's definitely more than 67. Um, well, let me flip each side. These do not match those envelopes. I don't know if they had envelopes um, or if they, this is probably something that came in one of the bags from the thrift store. Um, so five of these cards and they could be used to signature, but they're thick though. So this is not a light, uh, weight item in terms of, uh, pages, but, um, sometimes it's nice to include something cardy in the journal. Um, so five pack of these for 75 cents, five pack. Um, and they are approximately seven inches by five inches. So five pack, uh, blank cards. So you could make your own cards if you want to tea dye cards, but you have to make envelopes to go with them. Those are that one is seventy five cents, and the go is coming your way. Okay. Okay, you guys need to get that in there. Francis got that one. Okay. Ooh. 
Let me move that over here so I don't lose it. Okay. Next up, these are our tea dyed papers. Uh, 10 pat. Oh, wait, I went too far. I've got, I've got something besides. Okay. Make sure. Got all the. Okay. I believe these are all 10 packs. Let me just shuffle through here. Okay, so these are all 10 packs. Um, little, these are, uh, these are coffee dyed. Little bit of grunge, not a ton. Some minor markings from the racks. Uh, these top three are probably a little grungier than the rest. There's some stippling and some dripping marks. So, um, these are $3, 10 pack of coffee dried. Um, the color, I want to describe it as dirty. Like, uh, let me see. So this piece is white. You can see that this is white right here. And, uh, sometimes the coffee is light, but this is like, uh, I don't know. It just has, a, it's a medium color to start with. So it's, uh, dirty. <laughs> Uh, the ones on top uh, are a little more marked and a little less processed. Um, the iron did not like being outside in the cold. I'll say that. So um, I have seven packs available and they are $3 each. Hey, J-Mac, how you doing? You get here when you're, you get here when you're meant to get here. <laughs> we don't ever stay late around here. Okay, so uh, we got 10 packs. Coffee dyed. Twenty four pound paper. Uh, it is three dollars per pack, and the go is coming your way. All right. Let me slide those away in their spots. I got Peggy for one. And J Mac. And Francis. And Danielle. There are three left if anybody else is available. Um, J Mac, have I sold to you before? I think if I have, it's been quite a while. Would it be possible to get you to... Oh, hang on. Uh, if I could get you to send me your full name, a shipping address, and a PayPal email, that would be great. I It would just make it easier. I have trouble sometimes finding people. I'm sure it's in there, <laughs> but uh, you know how it is. Um, so after Danielle, I see Roseanne in there and that leaves two left. Thank you, ladies. It's super fun paper. I love it. I kept some for myself. It was too fun not to. That would be awesome, J-Mac. You are made of the awesome. Yay. Okay. Next item. There's just one of these. This is a 10 pack of tea dyed newsprint and it is $1.50. Uh, it is a, this is a light paper tea dyed. Um, and this, this batch was particularly light. Um, and you can see minimal markings. I towel dried these. Uh, so for people who like the super light, this might be something for you. It is the newsprint, the kindergarten writing paper. And this one is the lines going this way. So it's the, it's not kindergarten. It's actually first grade because the kindergarten paper goes this way and the lines go like that. So this is the first grade paper. And so we got a 10 pack newsprint tea dyed. And I misspelled newsprint. Awesome. Okay. Uh, and that is $1.50. Uh, and that is your go. Woo woo. 
I got Francis for the win on that one. Okay. Now this is something new. And it was a it was a scavenger find. Elf had it. And uh he didn't like it the way it was, which was um it was more white. Now this is a this is again the super light tea dye. That's why it was so light because we were doing this. And I didn't want to overpower it. This is a marbled paper. Um, you know, it looks like marble. I don't think it was made through a marbling process per se. Um, but it's that marble look paper. These are 10 packs of lightly tea dyed. It was much whiter and, and brighter. So um, we like we both like it better this way. It's coming off a little paler on camera than it is uh, live, live here with me. Um, so... Uh, So the 10 pack of tea dyed marble paper, did I just make it way darker, didn't I? Oh, but you can, if I don't have shadows on it, actually, that's looking a little more accurate. Okay. Um, so that is $3 for a 10 pack of the marbled paper. It is marbled on both sides. And it, uh, we knocked back that white with the tea dye process. 10 pack marbled um, and we think it is a 20, uh, I think we, I took it out to her earlier. We think it's a 24 pound paper. I don't think it is a 20 pound paper. I could be wrong though, but it feels uh, thicker than 20 to me. Feels more like what I normally dye. Uh, so $3 and the go is coming your way. And there are one, two, three of those available. Let's see what we got. I got Rebecca. Miss Krabby gets one. Francis and Danielle. Sorry, T Mac. I wish I wish I had more. Eh, I loved it. T died. I gotta tell you, when it was when it was regular, I didn't like it quite so much. Okay. So our next item is a variety pack of those planner refill pages we got a bag and it had like three or four kinds of these um and else had them for a while and um and then they came my way to be dyed so there's uh one of these lined on both sides and this is like a red kind of burgundy line that's doing that and then this one which is kind of green tint here um, there's a place for subject and date on here. And uh, then it goes over to the back side. So there are uh, two of those. There is one of these to-do lists. Things to do. And this is uh, like, uh, I don't know. It's like a, a, a light red. I wouldn't say pink, but it's also not brown. <laughs> and then these are just lined papers. Um, so there are one, two, three, four, five of those. And then this is a small, uh, grid print. I don't know if it's going to come out on the camera, but it is tiny, tiny grid, but it is only on one side. The black, the black, the back side is blank. Um, so I don't know if it's 10 squares per inch. I don't know if it's quite small enough for that, but it's not like the five squares print. This is a much smaller. This is not. Let me see if I turn the light this way, maybe. I don't know. that It's very light. It's faint. So I don't know if you can see it, but it is a grid, a grid on the front. So let me get this back in the right order now. Five of those. One of those. Two of those. I get confused if the fronts don't all look the same. I'm like, Whoa. and my brain is like, is that the same? Okay, so uh, these are, so it is a total of 14 pieces. One, two, one, five, five. <laughs> I think that's right. One, two, 
two, three, four. Yeah, that's right. 14 pieces. Okay, so we're going to, uh, and it is uh, uh, 250 for a pack. Uh, I can type, I can. 14 pack. Uh, be a variety. Yeah, variety. Planner. Refill pages. 2.50. And the go is coming your way. It's just a fun little pack to, and we we deliberately dyed them light. Uh, so these are tea dyed because um, I didn't want to obscure. Like if I dyed the this part any darker, I think uh, you wouldn't be able to even tell it was graph paper. J Mac, you'd like one of those? Okay. Let me grab the next item while you guys are deciding. Come on. And Francis and Roseanne. Okay. J Mac. Francis and Roseanne. Perfect. There are two left if anybody decides they need to have one. These are uh they are newsprint quality, so they're cheapy. Um, I bought it because it says, yes, I know guac is extra, but so am I. I just thought that was fun. Um, so there's a part where you can like tear this, but the circle goes away. So I left it as is. Um, in this pack, there's some that are, you know, they're a little bit, you know, uh, not perfect. But I made them extra cheap for you guys. It's a five pack for 25 cents. And there are... Um, six of those available so we've got five pack talk is extra for 25 cents and that is your go i just thought they were fun i have i kept a few for myself and it is on both sides so if you use it as a tip in um just know that it's super super lightweight it is a newsprint quality Okay, so we have got uh, Danielle, Francis, and Roseanne. Thank you, ladies. There are three still available. Okay, next up is a five pack. Um, this is from that desk cleanup book that I use. These are the pages I took out, some of them. I kept some. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. I have the whole book and I still wanted some. Um, I think it, I want to say it's more than five though. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it's eight pieces. Hold on. Yeah, eight. Eight pieces. Yeah. I don't know why I wrote five. It's eight pieces for $1.25. Um, so they're, uh, they're tea dyed lightly because it already had kind of a brown tint to the paper, like a creamy off white. So, uh, you got a couple of index pages in each one, not too much on the markings. I wanted the maps to be visible, you know, so we took it easy with this one, but there's still some marks on some papers. So it's just super fun. Uh, this is from a, like a. Uh, what's the word? It's from 1982 uh, or 84. One of those. Uh, it's Road Atlas uh, book. And I did, I ripped them out so that you have the funky fun edges. Uh, and there are five of those available. Thank you, J-Mac. I really appreciate it. You are awesome-tastic. Woo! Okay, so um, what it, these are $1.25. So it's an eight-pack Road Atlas. Phoenix and I it's 82 or 84 I can't remember so it's circa that era when I was a teenager <laughs> Phoenix map uh, so $1.25 for eight pieces and your go is coming 
and the go is coming your way. <laughs> While you guys are deciding, I'm going to put these away and grab the next item. Well done. So I've got Adria. Uh, Roseanne and Mari. And Francis. There's, there's one left. In case anybody decides later on they would like it. Uh, oh, here it is. Ha! Huh. I didn't call it half sheet. That's why. So these are the other um, partial sheet. These are cutoffs from Elsa's. Uh, something else made. And we can't decide. It's definitely a 20 pound paper. But it's not onion skin or typing paper. It didn't have a watermark on it. Um, and it feels different than a most 20-pound paper I've handled. So I'm. it is a 20-pound weight paper. But it's, I don't know, it's just more fun. So if you make like small journals or something, um, or you like to put small pieces in your journals, or you like to make lists, um, these are going to be $1.25. Oh, 10 pieces. I'm losing my mind. Uh -huh. These are going to be 75 cents. I priced it based on the other one, which had 25 pieces. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> so there are four of these and they are um, eight this way, five this way. So eight by five. Yes. Okay. No twerking. You know, what happened? I just couldn't see what you were selling. Okay, Captain Creepy. Adria, you like the creamsicle pack? Okay. Did you say you fell asleep on us? That's okay. No worries. Let me get back to the creamsicle. Um, here we go. So, uh, Adria. Okay, if anybody's keeping track, that means there are now two available. Okay, Adria. I know who you all are. The reason I put your last initials on there for the most part is because I have very bad handwriting. And so it helps me separate like Mary from Mari if they're both in or uh, if two names look kind of the same. It's the last initial that always does it for me. My brain is tired too, hon. I worked like 16 hours a day for three days in a row. And I think I've had maybe a total of uh, two to four hours a night. <laughs> Very bad is an understatement. Okay. So we're doing the uh, 8 by 5 scrap packs. Uh, those are coffee dyed. And they're a dirty. It's the dirty look paper. So uh, I just think they're fun. And uh, let's do this too. There are not really any markings on it. But it is a good medium paper. And the edges are dark. So um, I love that paper, honestly. Coffee dyed in a 75 cents a pack. And the go is coming your way. I should have been a... Or a serial killer. Okay. Where are we going with this? It would help if I wrote on the right line. So I've got Danielle. Uh J Mac, two for you. And then it's Mari. We will always be looking for cutouts from Elle. She gives us some of the stuff like this. Like she used to just chuck this stuff away. And I'm like, don't you chuck that away? I have a set just for me to write stuff on. <laughs> I, I'm a listy person and I love the feel of different paper textures, you guys. Love, love, love it. Oh, share instead of giving you two. Oh, you guys are so nice. I'm telling you right now. I wouldn't be having any of that stuff. <laughs> so we got JMAC for one. And after Mari is... Christine gets one. Yay! I do not have enough, though. That's, that's the end. There were only four. Okay, next up... 
I can do this. Where did it go? Uh oh. Oh, there it is. I just didn't take it out. Okay. So this is 67 pound cardstock. You can feel it. It's got a nice weight to it. And it's got some text. You can do it. Sure. What are you eating? I don't I can't, I can't tell what that is. That's gross. And you just stop doing that and just tell me what it is. Oh, my God. Like that. You came in here with chewing and said you could do it. Now you won't tell me what you're eating? Cashews. I was eating. I don't know. You and your nuts. My nice nuts. Oh, you got the nice nuts. I heard that about you. Oh I got grapes for you. You did, and they're juicy and fat. And Mike's about to cut us up a nice fresh can of it. Are we having chicken or no chicken? Chicken. Chicken? Barbecue chicken, with baked beans, cauliflower. My life is so good if I could just get enough freaking sleep. Okay. Uh, sorry, guys. And, uh, Danielle says, else. Okay, so these do have some drying rack marks on them. These are coffee dyed, but they are light to medium in tone. And the markings are medium at best. So uh, if you like it a little bit lighter, I, I can't say this is as light as some of the other stuff we've seen. But uh, it's a light to medium. So it's lighter over here and a little bit darker over here. 67 pound cardstock. And it is textured. So, um, I, it might be Nina, maybe. Nina Karstock. Um, it feels nice. Dollar twenty-five, and it is a five-pack. So, five-pack, 67-pound cardstock. Uh, there are five available, and they are $1.25 a piece. Ooh, and I, Karstock. Yeah. Never mind my spelling in here. You can all talk about it later. You can point and laugh if you like. Uh, my brain's on the fritz. Francis, two for you. Times two. And then we got Leah. Danielle. Oh, wait. Did I miss J-Mac? I got Francis, Leah. Okay, you wanted a second. Okay. Um, so I've got Danielle and only one left, J Mac. I hope that's okay. You guys are so in in, 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 in I'm okay, I swear. Okay. So those are all sold. Thank you, ladies. I love this cardstock. It feels so nice. Okay. Where's my next item? Ten pack. Where'd the columnar paper go? Where was the columnar paper? Oh, I see it up here. You see in a special place. So, um, I don't think this is vintage. I think uh, it might not be like recent. Recent. I would say probably the oldest it is is the eighties. But it could be from any time between the eighties and now. It is uh, this stuff that's got like the. I don't know what kind of book it goes into, but it makes a nice size page and it is a nice weight of paper. I want to say it's probably a 24 pound paper. Um, this is light tea dyed and it's got some medium markings on it, but mostly it's just light. So you've got uh, red lines dividing here and then uh, the lines are blue. These ones in here are a little bit darker. But how fun is that? So uh, these are uh, ledger slash columnar papers. Uh, let me see if I can see. You've got... Uh, it's from Wilson Company. 10-4 white. G10 slash 4 dash 4 green. Um, so if that means anything to anybody, <laughs> okay, that works for me that, and that, that way, if it's extra, I can be just like, there we go. Uh, I like it that way. Very nice. Okay. So it's 10 packs of this columnar slash ledger paper, horizontal orientation, light T medium markings. And, uh, 
there are five available. Um, and these are uh, 350 each. 50, a uh, 10 pack, Palmer slash Ledger. And it is T. Did I say T? Okay. And the go is coming your way. Elle's laughing her butt off about something. Okay, so let's have a look at what we've got going on. Roseanne. Danielle. Francis. And J-Mac. Times two. Gotcha. Oh, well, I appreciate it. Although it does kind of look like you're pointing at yourself a little bit. So all of those are sold. Thank you, ladies. I think I smell cauliflower cooking. Thank you, thank you. Right, let's slide that in there. Next up is... Uh, Oh, I put it in two places. I'm a genius. I think I only have one for the moment. Yeah. See, that's what happens when you're tired. All right, so we are going to do some file folders, ladies. Uh, these were gifted to me. Uh, so we have uh, an uneven amount. So I'm going to do this by the piece. Uh, so it's like this contents. You've even got a line on the thing. This does have two of the prongs. Um, they can be taken out. This set is a little more uh, hard, more difficult because you have to bend these portions up and they are difficult. I would recommend careful with needle nose pliers or uh, some kind of metal implement that's very sturdy but thin. Um, this will pull off, but you have to be careful. You might try a heat tool first because uh, it will leave bare cardboard. Now, I don't mind because it'll be white when you peel it off. I peeled off one that I kept for myself. I kept like six, honestly. But I peeled it up to see what would happen. Um, and it does leave white behind. You can uh, put ink on that or you can just take a little coffee or tea that you made yourself and cover that up if you want to. Um, so if you don't like that part of it, it does have the Pendaflex markings. And we think these are maybe from the, again, the 80s. That seems to be a theme. Um, so there are these kind of peachy ones. So those are all the right full rights. And then we have mids, which are blue. Uh, and then we have uh, lefts, which are... Uh, this kind of purpley color and yellow. You can specify if you want. Uh, I will tell you that on the on the right side, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those are green, and two, three of those are pink. All of the middles are blue, and uh, then we have the the rights which are yellow, one, two, three, four, five, are uh, this, this purpley kind of color, and three are yellow. So uh, we'll go, we'll go uh, lefts first to save us the trouble. These are 50 cents each. Um, these are coffee dyed, and they are, uh, they do have, you know, a fair amount of grunge and markings. So that should, they're all kind of the same to these. Um, so we're going to start with the left tab. Mauve, there you go. Okay. Um, yeah, always please wait for the go. <laughs> Otherwise, because it has to be fair for everybody. Um, where am I going with this? So left tab. File folder. 
are uh, 50 cents and go. One, two, four, five, six, seven. Seven of the green and three of the pink. J Mac would like, okay. So. Okay, so J Mac would like one of each. I've got uh, Danielle times two of the green, okay? Good. Uh, Roseanne would like a green one. Danielle, I got Danielle. Mari, two. Sandy would like the pink. Mari for two. Leah, two, green. Uh-oh. Mari, do you care if yours are pink or green? Okay, so... We'll do um, Mari times one green, Mari times one uh, pink, and then we'll give the two, the six and the seven, to Leah, who prefers two greens. Okay, got it. So I'm going to read it off. J-Mac, one uh, green, one pink. Danielle times two green. Roseanne, one green. Mari, one green, one pink. Leah, two green. Uh, J. I'm going to write that again, J. Uh, Sandy, one pink. No, nope, I think that I think we got everybody in there. I don't think we missed anybody. Okay, so that left sides are done. <laughs> We're going to go into the middle tab. All the middle tabs are blue. Blue, 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 blue. And those are, again, 50 cents. And the go is there for you. Thank you for offering, though, Leah. I really appreciate your guys' flexibility and kindness to one another. So one, two, three, four, five. So we have five available. Two, four, five. So we've got Roseanne for one. We have got J-Mac for two. And Mari for one. And Leah for one. Perfect. You ladies are awesome. Okay. Now, this last one, we have one. Two, three, four, five of the mauve and three of the yellow. So, one, two, three, five, and the yellow. One, two, three. Again, 50 cents, and this is for the right tabs. All right, your go is there. J-Mac, one of each. Adria for Mauve. Roseanne for Mauve. Danielle would like one of each.
Mari, there's only one mauve left. Is that okay? And Leah for the yellow. Okay, so I got, so on that I've got JMAC for one of each. I've got Adria for uh, mauve, Roseanne for mauve, Danielle for mauve, Mari for mauve, Danielle for yellow, and Leah for yellow. And that's all of them. Woo woo. You guys are made of awesome. Okay, so next up is, uh, okay, so on this one I have, Let's see. Do I have it? Oh, please. T9. I'm intense. I'm missing. I'm missing one. Oh, please. Oh, there it is. Okay. So for the dot matrix, I have one 25 pack and three 10 packs. We're going to do the 10 packs first, and then we'll do the 25 pack. Uh, so these are a uh, medium, a light color uh, with medium to light markings. Uh, and these are tea dyed. Pretty even coloring throughout. So we'll do the tens first, which are uh, three twenty-five, and the twenty-five pack is eight dollars. So we'll start with the tens. <laughs> so here we go: ten pack T dot matrix, and the dot matrix is twenty pound paper. Um, most of what I found, I don't think I've ever found anything in dot matrix that was not 20 pound or less. <laughs> uh, on the tens, it's three dollars and 25 cents. I can I can type, and that is a go. Three of those in the tens. So I got uh, J. I got Danielle. And then I've got Roseanne and J Mac. Okay. And then the, I'll do the 25 pack. Uh, 20 pound uh, matrix. T. $8 for the 25 pack. And there is the go if there's any interest on that one. All right. Next up is nine by nine baking parchment. This is coffee dyed and it does, it's a little grungy. This is easy to make grungy though. That's what we've got coming up next. It is 9x9 nine nine baking parchment, coffee dyed, $2 for a 10 pack. Uh, 10 pack, 9x9 nine nine baking parchment, uh, $2. And there is your go. I have got Adria, and there are five of those. And then I've got Danielle and J Mac and Roseanne. 
There's one of those left. Okay. You'll take the last one? Okay. I saw it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. We have these fairly often. I found these in the bottom of a pile. Um, these are coffee dyed. Um, this one's not quite as grungy as these two, I think. Or maybe it's just the top page that's oh there's that's that one's got some nice so I would say these are medium grungy. The paper itself is fairly light dyed, but there are some marks from the uh, drying racks. These are from the 70s. They're memo uh you know people used to type memos even. <laughs> so it's from this publishing company, uh and they apparently have been in business since 19, 1798. They either went out of business or changed their stationery because I have I have like three pads of it tucked away and I've been doing it slowly. <laughs> so there are three of these and uh, it's five pieces for 50 cents. Uh, so the five pack, 70s memo. Uh, is this tea or coffee? It's coffee. For 50 cents. Go. Oops. What'd I do? You think they publish Bibles? You can make memos that say anything. <laughs> Roseanne, I see you before the go, but since nobody else seems interested, I'm going to go ahead. And there are three available. I wrote down two, but there are three. So, Roseanne, I'll go ahead and get you in there. All right. Moving on. Ooh, ooh. We can do this. Okay. So, this is a, a not too common occurrence. I just dyed these. It's a new thing that we found. I have a couple packs of them. I have some in green and some in blue. I only dyed green ones. And I would say it's about a 67 pound weight. They are door hangers. It is not perforated. So I don't know if you're meant to print on it or type on it and then uh, fold it over and you have a double like little booklet-y thing. It does have the line here where you can, uh, so you could use it for a big tall tag or a page in a journal. You could cut that off if you wanted to. Um, they're door hangers. So I have uh, eight available in sets of two. And this is a freebie. It is yours for free as long as you have bought something. Uh, you'll get uh, two pages of that in with your order at no charge. Where It's just a sample. See if, you know, you guys put it, take it and play with it and stuff. So, uh, two pack. Oh, there's why because I never put it in the go. That's for the previous item. <laughs> Hold on. Two pack, door hanger. Uh, this is tea dyed. And it was green naturally. Um, it's a freebie. And there is your go. So, J-Mac, you'd like one set? Perfect. Oh, wanted a memo pack? Sure. Never mind. So, one of, so one of the 70s memos, J-Mac, and one of the... And Roseanne will take one. And Leah. Anybody else for that last set? No charge. I just thought it would be fun if you guys got a chance to play with them and see if you like it at all. I don't want to waste my time dying it if nobody's <laughs> interested. Sandra, you'd like one set? All right. Okay, I have a couple of non-dyed items. So 
and their book page things over here. You guys are so welcome. No worries. Oh, oh bless you. I'm starving. <laughs> One for the other hand. A couple for the other hand. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Cantaloupe. All right, this is a non-dyed. I have to do it one-handed now. I've touched the... All right. So there are three single sheets. These are... It was a book of quotations about friendship uh, and family. Mostly about friendship, though. These are mostly religious in nature. Um, some are not, but most of these are religious in nature. Um, so here is a French proverb. A faithful friend is an image of God. Um, Helen Keller said, life is a chronicle of friendship. Friends create the world anew each day. Without their loving care, courage would not suffice to keep hearts strong for life. So it's th that sort of quotes. And um, so three single sheets and then one, two, three, four, five, six. Six signature sheets, and I didn't measure these ahead of time. So let's grab a ruler. Six by four and a half. So six and three is nine. eight pages though some of them may only have two 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 uh i think this one just has an extra so eight pieces for 75 cents uh five signatures two single sheets the one with three will be given out at random i don't do favorites so we'll just throw that in there okay so undyed item, if you're interested, I'm going to go ahead and type it in there. Uh, Carla! You guys are crazy. So um, eight pieces. Quotes, book pages, four seven. Five cents, and there is your go. It's okay if you're not interested. I thought I'd give it a go. I kept uh, a portion of secular ones. I'm not big into the religious quotes, but I know some of you guys are, and um, there's nothing wrong with them. They're beautiful quotes. It's just not my cup of, you know. Else you'll take one. I just wrote me on the line. Oh my god. And Roseanne. Um, there were four available, so there's still two if anybody's interested. This one is a buy the piece item. They're out of this little bitty book right here, uh, Country Home Inspirations by Merrill. I'm sure that's the publisher. Um, they are, let me, all of these are signature sheets. There's no singles. So it's buy the piece. These are um, five by five. They're just a smidge off of 5x5. Five five. Um, no, they're actually 5x5. Five five. I thought they were smidge off when I measured them earlier. Going this way, it's just slightly under 5. Going uh, up up and down, where, uh, it's a little bit. So um, somebody suggested you could put little people in there. You could add to it. I intend to use them mostly as pages in smaller books. Um, and sometimes I like to use small pages in big books that I make. Um, so this is going to be by the piece. Uh, um, two cents a page. You know, so I'm just showing you a few to get it. I'm not going to go through every single one. But I think you could easily insert people into a number of these and make some fun, you know, added in collage type stuff. I know that's getting kind of popular. Anyone like this, you could maybe glue this down to a different page and make a pocket and then have, you could cover it up entirely. 
Um, I will say that they are glossy pages. So if you're going to want to write on them or anything, you may want to put a little gesso or white paint on there. So I think you kind of get the picture. There are 39 pieces of this. And I kept some. <laughs> I kept quite a bit. Um, at two cents a piece. And uh, you just say how many you want. Yes. <laughs> they can. Um, so, uh, buy the piece. Uh, 0.02. Go. So, if you're interested. I know, I realize that nobody may be interested, but I thought... Because I thought it was cute. Maybe some of you would too. Else you'd like 10. Okay, that takes it down to 29. Uh, Roseanne for 10. That takes it down to 19. Mari would like 10. That makes it nine. Uh, J Mac, are you okay with nine? Because that's what's left. I'm sorry. Would would that be okay for you? Okay, perfect. All right, those are sold. You guys are made of the awesome. I just I was very taken by them, but I knew I could not use thirty nine of them. Plus, I think I kept uh, about twenty five. So. <laughs> All right, this is the last tea dyed item, and then we're going to go into orange paper. I'm going to put one up here. They are all slightly different, but the same, and you'll see what I mean when I pull it out. Um, this is a uh, miscellaneous grab bag of things that have just been accumulating as I die. You know, if I have one of something, I'll throw it in a vat, and then I'll put it in a box. And every now and then I take those uh, things in the box and I make them into a pack. A lot of this is from this sale. Um, this is from a different sale here. So there are two of these. It's about 45 pieces. I think it's actually a little bit more than 45. Um, so these two big ledger pages. Then there are uh, two of these ones from the sale today. There is... Uh, this one's a little damaged. Two dot matrixes. There is one map piece. Um, I think it's area codes. And then this side is a different. So I thought that might be fun to add in. Uh, we've got some tea dyed paper that was. Uh, it's got some stippling, grungy kind of. Um, so each pack contains basically the same things. There may be slightly less or slightly more of certain items. And some packs may have one item or a substituted for another. Um, so you can see this is where uh, this was the outside page on that orange sickle paper. So these are divided in there. Um, I think there's three of those. And then we've got some uh, tea dyed scrapbook paper. And it is a paperweight paper, not cardstock. Uh, blank on the back. So we've got some polka dotties. Some stripies. I don't think there's more than two. And some of them only have one of each pattern there. A couple sheets of newsprint. There's either one or two sheets of the baking uh, parchment. There's one or two of the map. There's a... Uh, like this one is damaged. There's a piece of stationery. And a half sheet of paper. This is one of those planner pages from a different dyeing session. It has tiny green lines all through it. Uh, same. One uh, oval doily. Um, and then there are single sheets of this. I believe there's five in each one. Great for lining things or adding, uh, folding it in half and like tucking it in a pocket. There's one envelope that's pretty grungy and wrinkled. And then there's just a variety in each uh, pack. Th this one has some tickets, a couple of these uh, listy type things. There's a tag in this one. Each one does have one of these glassine bags. 
a couple of non-lined uh, index cards, another bed of tickets, a receipt, and here's a, like a little map page. They all have similar but not exactly the same. Uh, I think a couple of them may not have tickets. Who's yelling? Hey, Rosemary, how's it going? You're working late in the yard. Oh, getting that yard work in. You got to get in when the weather's good, right? So uh, there is slightly more than 45, but because each kit's slightly different, one may have 46, one may have 47. I put 45 to be safe so that I'm not lying to anybody about how many pieces are in their pack. And uh, these are 750 for the 45 pieces. Um, so it's just a fun little, like, I guess a stash builder, or if you want to make just kind of a grungy, fun, eclectic journal, that this is a good way to start. So um, this is 45 pieces, uh, tea dyed, tea and salt coffee. There's both. I think most of it's tea though. Tea slash coffee dyed miscellaneous pieces. It's, uh, yeah, we'll make it 650 for you guys. We'll drop it down and go. And there are five of these available. Let me change that here so I don't forget. And then I overcharge you. So there are five of those available. So I've got Roseanne and J-Mac. And Leah. There are two available if anybody gets the urge. There's definitely enough stuff in there to create a journal. It just wouldn't be like all the same size pages. Yes, ma'am. If I searched hard enough, long enough, far enough. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> I need several of the Lucy's. <laughs> Check it out, people. Peanuts die cut. She's finally found it. Mike is known as Charlie Brown, in case you didn't know. <laughs> it's brand new. Just yeah. came out. It just came out. So you snagged it? Of course I did. All right. So there's two more of those left, and we're going to move on to orange paper, people. We are a third of the way through that, and there's a creamsicle ash shaking in my face. Roseanne says she loves those. She loves them. I'll remember that when I send her a happy mail. All right. So I'm passing this information along. I'm an okay person. Okay. So we are starting with, well, get yourself under control. And this is where I'm going to show you. These are both newsprint papers. You can see this came out a nice light orange and this is much darker. Yeah, she does, right? So just so you know, the, as we go through, you'll see a range of color. Could be as light as this, could be as dark as this. Newsprint sometimes really sucks up the color and sometimes it doesn't. I don't know. I think different brands just do different things. But we are starting with... Not this. Okay. These. So I have two different kinds. We're going to do them one after the other. Are we? Are we doing that? Yeah. So this is grungy. And this is sort of not grungy. <laughs> so I'm going to show you what I mean. First of all, I want to, want to say that these were originally blank on the back. What's going on here, and I don't know if you'll be able to tell, is there's a line here. And then there's a small gap. And then there's a longer line over here. Um, I'm not really sure what it's for. Maybe some kind of note taking. This came in a bag from uh, Goodwill or Savers. I don't know. It's a scaventure find. Um, but there was some transfer. So on the back side, it's lined, but sometimes it's crooked. And this is considered the not grungy paper. So it's a little bit lighter. You can see the lines better. Like I said, the backs, it's a toss-up. Sometimes it's sideways. Sometimes it's, it's how the paper rests against each other in the thing. So the lines were originally darker than they appear on the front, but obviously there was some cross-contamination. So these are the less grungy ones. 
These ones, uh, it is hard to see the lines, period, regardless of front or back. But they are awesomely modeled. Um, I saved a whole bunch of these for myself. I immediately saw them and I went, oh, and I got an idea for a project. I had to have some. There are occlusions, places where the dye, there were bubbles and the dye didn't take. I personally love those, but um, just so you're aware, not everybody does love those. More occlusions there. It just means there was bubbles trapped in between the pages. So we're going to do the, uh, the grungy first. And I have three packs of the grungy and two packs of the not quite so grungy. So we're doing these ones first. It's 10 pieces per, and it is $4 a pack. Um, there would be more, but I had to have some. Linus is, yes, Linus is missing his blankie, right? Boo on that, but otherwise, awesome. <laughs> so 10 pack, crunchy. Oops. Nope, now I'm playing with my own. I didn't have the cursor in the little box. 10 pack, crunchy, orange. I'm just going to call it lined paper. And we do think that this is a 24 pound paper also. Um, no, 20. I think this is a 20 pound paper. It does have kind of a, I don't know, almost a slick feel to it, but I, I'm in love with this paper. And I can't spell the word paper, so there's that. Uh, $4 per. And there is your go if you are interested in this particular orange paper. Orangey big orange orange. So uh, three packs available. It looks like they have sold. We got Roseanne. Don't worry, we have the slightly less grungy other ones. <laughs> and Danielle. Okay, so we'll go ahead and type in for this because I've already showed it to you. Um, there's two packs and like I said, they're just not as grungy and the lines are clearer on these pages. So depending on what you want to do with it, uh, 10 pack less grungy, orange liner, uh, same price. And there is your go. Two of those available. Okay, let me figure out what's next. Um, okay, next up is sandwich wrap. And this uh, sandwich wrap is on crack. It's 9 by 12, but you can see from the edges that there was a variety of uh, this. Usually they're all pretty much the same size. This is the most variation I've seen in size and any one pack. So just be aware that they're supposed to be nine by 12, but they may not quite make it there. Um, so, and it's a lighter orange for the most part. Got a couple of wrinkly pieces, it happens. So uh, these are, so nine by 12 uh, sandwich wrap with its fun noise, 250 a pack. There are seven available. Roseanne, you want one of those orange orange lined ones? Okay. One still available on that. So we've got a 10 pack. Is it a 10 pack? Yeah, 10 pack. Nine by 12 sandwich wrap in coral. And it is 250. And there is your go. But Danielle for one of those. Awesome. Okay, no other takers? No worries. 
there are one, two, three, four, five, six still available. Here are 10 of these. I in no way feel that all 10 of these are going to sell. Um, some of these are for the, you know, I die enough to put in the Etsy shop too. <laughs> but I like to offer it to you guys first. You get first crack, um, best prices. So these are orange uh, embossed placemats. It is um, kind of a floral pattern, but there are some like diamond shapes and stuff. And I don't know if it's going to come across on the screen. Uh, but let me get a measurement for you. I think they're a uh, 10 by 14. I'm not, not going to swear it, but I think 10, approximately 10 by, yeah, 14. With, you know. And you can see there's a little color variation. There's not much in the way of markings on this because it's a very lightweight. This is less than 20 pounds. So it's a very lightweight, place matty kind of paper. But they're fun if you make bigger journals or you can cut them down too. You want some of the sandwich wrap, uh, Janice? Welcome back. <laughs> Let me go over here and get you some of the sandwich wrap. We haven't done coral in a while. Um, so, uh, it's a, it's a five pack coral embossed placements. Nine by, or 10 by 14, 10 by 14. And the price on these is uh, 175. And there is your go. Okay, let's get those put away. Janice will take one. Okay. Next up, we're doing the uh, three-hole punch. This is newsprint uh, grid paper, and it is light. We do have the regular newsprint, the uh, first grade paper, which is darker. So just giving you a spin through so you can see the... There are some darker parts, uh, but it's not as dark as that other, the other newsprint. So these are $1.75 for a 10-pack on the new, on the, and the newsprint, uh, the first grade newsprint is going to be the same. There are seven of these available, so 10-pack. Uh, J-Mac, you want one of the uh, embossed placemats as well? Gotcha. So 10-pack on uh, newsprint. Newsprint red coral um, 1.75 and the go is coming your way. Okay, Danielle, you'll take two of those. Janice will take one. Okay. Now, uh, next up, we have the, the darker. The lines are there. Um, they go horizontally this way, but they are very faint. And in a few of them, it's really, really hard to see them. So, but you get an idea. It's pretty dark. You'll have a few lighter patches here and there where the paper's overlaid, but it is definitely darker than uh, the grid paper. Uh, this will be $1.75 also for a 10 pack. I got you, Roseanne. On the previous one, there are still three available. Okay, uh, 10 pack, coral, use print first grade, 175. And there is your go. Okay. I'm 
I'm not sighing because of how the sale's going. It's hot in here. <laughs> it's very hot in here. And I'm dropping stuff on the ground. Not sale stuff, just other stuff. Okay, so we got Danielle and Roseanne for those. Okay, there are one, two, three, four, still five left. Okay. All right, we have 110 pound cardstock for this one. So uh, let me just, this is hard to flip. <laughs> It is uh, light to medium. I think there's a pretty fair mix. Little bit of occlusions. Uh, not really any rack marks on these that I can tell. So, uh, five pack of 110 pound uh, coral cardstock is uh, $1.50. There are nine available. So, five pack. Coral cardstock. Coral, hundred and ten. Cardstock, one fifty, and go. Janice, you'll take one. Well, I'll, I'll start explaining, you know, I know there's a little bit of lag and people are deciding what they do and don't want to buy. Um, so this is like the other paper, uh, the tea dyed. I have a 25 pack. Uh, this is, a, a, we've got a nice medium shade in here. There are some that'll have a little bit lighter because it's done in a couple different batches. So you can see there are some lighter uh, pages in there. That's the 25 pack, and then we'll take a spin through the. The uh, 10 packs, so we'll do the 10 packs first, and then we'll do the 25 pack second. So this is 20 pound uh, dot matrix paper. Uh, 10 packs are four dollars and the uh, 25 pack when we get to it will be uh, 10. 10 pack. 24 pound coral. Paper, $4. There is your go. And there are five of the 10 packs. Roseanne and Danielle. Thank you, ladies. And Janice, gotcha. And I'm gonna put in the, I don't know if there'll be any interest. Usually those go to the uh, just Etsy store. Um, 25 pack coral, 20 pound dot matrix. So, and that is 10. And your go. Okay. Rosemary, you'd like that one? Perfect. Thank you very much. Hope you got lots of yard work done, but you didn't wear yourself out too much. All right, now we're hitting the 24 pound paper. We're almost to the end of the orange. All right, so here's the thing. I have some that are darker with stippling on it and stippling uh, in in dye in this particular turn. I don't know if it's going to show up. 
a lot of these pages have little dots of where there was more dye than the paper soaked up in the vat. So it rests on the paper and it dries that way. I'm trying to see. Because my thing gets behind. So I'm usually not live on my own live. Here we go. So let me see. Like this one has quite a bit. So I say this paper is grungier because it's not. And, and then the, look, these are the occlusions where it doesn't stay white. It, um, so I'm going to show two sets of the same thing, essentially. I have a 25 pack and some 10 packs with the stippling. And then I have a 25 pack and some 10 packs without. Not everybody likes the stippling. And these are fairly even in color. There are a few darker ones and a few lighter ones. But none of the stippling, really. You may find an odd one here or there. So we'll do the stippling first, and then we'll come to the non-stippling. So if you have a preference, um, I just wanted to make you aware. So we'll start with the 10 packs and then go to the 25. Your poop and... Oh, not mosquito bitten. Ew. I'm sorry to hear about that. We're starting to get to that point. We have flies out already because it's been warm and then cold and then warm. But the flies are like, we're here to stay. Okay. Let me see here. I'm making sure. Okay. So uh, in the stippling, there are two 25 packs and four 10 packs. We're going to start with the 10s and then move to the 25s. And it's okay if there's no interest. I'm just putting it out there. <laughs> 10 pack. Oh, I get it again. I, I'll make it, I'll push the live button and then I don't put the cursor back. 10 pack coral, 24 pound width. And I'm making all kinds of spelling errors. I apologize. Um, so it's uh, for the 10 pack. I need to write this. It's $4. And for the 20 pack, it's $10. 25 pack, I'm sorry. Okay. Stippling. And that is four dollars. So, uh, and there is the go for that one. So this is with stippling ten packs. Okay, so we got Leah for one of those. Okay, and then I'm going to go ahead and push the button on the 25 pack while I put these away and bring up the, uh, the regular. Okay. I got Roseanne. Let's see. So I got Leah and then Roseanne for the 10 pack. Okay. Now we're moving on to the regular. I have one. I have two. I have two 25 packs again and three 10s. So let's, here we go. Well, no. There's that for you if anybody's interested. So I see, uh, oh, I thought I saw somebody, but now I don't. Never mind. Okay, and I'm going to go ahead and put in the 25 pack, uh, and I'll put these away, and we'll move on to the next thing. Okay. Next up we have, oh, now I see Rebecca under the 10 packs. It wasn't there for a second. Uh, regular for 10, Rebecca. 
Gotcha, Rebecca. Okay. So this is 11 by 17. It's going to be a five pack of the 11 by 17, uh, 20 pound. This is not the 32. It's the 20 pound um, ledger size paper. There are five sheets per pack, 11 by 17. It is $3 a pack, and there are six of these available. Five pack. 20 pound coral, 11 by 17. $3. And the go is coming your way. And this is our last orange item. Roseanne, you'd like one of those? Gotcha. And Rebecca, you'll take one of those as well? Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Last one. I have three uh, of these packs. It is a three pack of coral colored file folders. A left, a right, and a center. These came out pretty dark. Uh, file folders sometimes do. Like I said, it's um, um, these are Smead, uh, I think. They might not all be the same. Most of the, this one doesn't have a marking. So some of them do and some of them don't. Um, most of our file folders are scavenger finds. Um, sometimes even when we find a box, they're not the same. Uh, so may or may not have, I think this is the lightest of the three. These two are um, darker. You can see that. So if you have a preference, if you prefer the light one, say light. Otherwise, um, it'll just be random. But I know some people have a definite color preference. So three pack coral file folders. And those are, uh, where'd they go? $4. And there is your go. I kept uh, three packs of these for myself. I can never resist the file folders. Okay, Rosemary will take two dark ones. Uh, where'd we go? So there's only three sets. Let's see. Times two. All right, hold on. Let me bring up the ones I set aside. Oh, please. Did I? No, oh, these are different. No, I don't have any extras. The ones I have are prongy ones. Okay. So that's rosemary for two and... Uh huh? Daniela, are you okay? Uh, it's the one that's left would be the light one. Is that okay with you or do you want to pass on it? Okay. And those are sold. Sorry, ladies. I didn't know they would be that popular. I would have died more. Sometimes it's a toss up with the, with those. Okay. We're heading into pink. Um, we have been on for. Uh, two hours. I'm going to take a brief potty break for like two and a half minutes. If you guys are thirsty or you need to go potty too. Um, but don't fear because uh, Halloween's coming around. You know there's going to be some more orange, ladies. Never a shortage of orange. We're going to head into the pink now. And it's going to be about the same amount of stuff. Um, although I shouldn't have like, I don't know. I shouldn't have two sets of the regular paper, the 24 pound. Um, so we're, we're almost done, but I need a potty break. So I hope you guys are okay with that. And I will be right back. Uh, <laughs> heading into the pink. And then I have a, a, a couple of small giveaways for you at the very end. We can do a recap if you like, but I think most of you have been in the whole time.
Ooh, the whole house smells like cauliflower. Makes me hungry. Okay. <laughs> so we'll wait uh, a minute or so. If other people had to go potty or they wanted to get a snack or a drink, we'll give them a minute. It's great to see you all. For those of you who came in late, thank you. Thank you for coming and spending a little time with me. But I will make note for the next time that I dye orange to do a, a little bit more file folders for you guys. I love file folders and I love the colored ones. I love the tea dyed ones. I just love file folders. They're awesome. Can you tell I love file folders? <laughs> All right. As you guys come back to say you're back. And when I see a majority of you have said back, I will go ahead and start back up with our pink part of the sale. Nobody tells uh, Susan that we did a whole pink part of the sale. I know she does. It's not her color, but I thought she's not going to send me hate mail over it or anything. Usually you get a barf emoji if Susan sees the pink. Um, yes, I will do a recap if you would like. No problem at all. I'll start from the front and we'll and we'll go through it real quick. And uh, I don't have any. I I always do it on if Betty does like pink. <laughs> I think they have their fill of my paper though. Um, they used to buy a lot, and I think they haven't been crafting for a while because it's hard to get up and down those stairs. Uh, you're starting your Halloween mix already. Did you see that? Uh, Never left bladder all clear. <laughs> Some of you guys have bladders of steel. Mine's a two hour. I hit the two hour mark and that's the end of it. Let me get to the beginning here real quick. Leah. Yeah, you bought one of those uh, the uh, coffee filter sets that would be great for fall and winter. Um, I didn't realize people started so early. So I'm trying to get some in. But over the next couple months, um, April is going to be goth rainbow. Uh, I only have uh, seven of the packs that sold. There's only going to be three left. I have, like, pre-orders. Um, you don't have to pay to pre-order. But the goth rainbow uh, is a really dark purple, black, uh, a dark gray. It's going to be a chocolate brown. Um, there's going to be um, an or a uh, falling, a, a darker version of the falling leaves and um, one or two other colors. I'm still dying my way through it. Three of the colors are done. But uh, you may like that as well, Leah, when it comes around. Uh, I can put your name on the pre-order list if you'd like. Uh, let me see. I know that it's in here somewhere. Hold on. Um, you don't have to pay ahead of time. Um, it just reserves you the pack. And if the time comes around and it's ready and you're no longer interested, you're not obligated to buy, obviously. I put the list in here somewhere. That's what I get for pre-order Frankie's. Yes. Me. Okay. Hi. Would you like me to make you a plate of food? No, I'll come get it after. Okay. Barbecue's a little messy for sale. It, I didn't put any sauce on it. It's just off the grill. Okay. But it's chicken and okay. paper, and it's right. a bad idea. But thank you. I appreciate All it. Right. Okay. Just checking. I'm not telling anybody you're a nice man, you jerk. No, I'm just trying to make concerned <laughs> over, you know, I know. blood sugar drop. She gave me a few pieces of cantaloupe. I'm good for right now. Okay. Just checking it on um, Yes. Hi, everyone. Mr. Mike. Carla says, hover. Hey, Carla. I got the Frankies in here. Where did I do with the golf rainbow? Okay, I'll put golf rainbow right here. And I, I, I think I know where the other list is. Uh, 
Janice. I think you might be on the list, Janice. And Leah. But I've got you here just in case. Leah B. Okay. Um, that'll be out at the end of April along with the Frankie, which is the purple, which is the light green paper. The lime green with the purple on the edges, like that orange. On the... Um, so they'll be out uh, roughly at the same time. Okay. Uh, let's get this pink taken care of, ladies. Okay. We are starting with sandwich wrap. Here we go. Here is our pink sandwich wrap. And uh, this is very light. Again, this is all from the same pack. The paper is supposed to be 9.5 by 11. There is going to be variation. I'm, I didn't have any control over that. <laughs> or the pastel. It's not pastel. Pastel gauziness. I think you're on the list, Carla. I, I have it in another notebook. I'm trying to get everything into one notebook, though. So I'll combine the list, and I will... Uh, it's up here. I should tab it. I should tab it. Tab it real good. Carla. Okay. I, I'm pretty sure you're on the list, but better safe than sorry. That's some pink for I know, isn't it? Okay, so uh, there are six packs. Wait, no. There are six and seven. There are 13 of these. Be a little carried away. Some of it's for the obviously so it is a five pack that's why there are so many five packs some okay so some things are ten and some things are five I've gotten messages and feedback from people that on some of the items they'd like to see half as much and it's not necessarily the cost they just don't need ten so um, this is a five pack of the sandwich wrap and it is um, two dollars the five pack pink nine by 12 sandwich wrap for uh 150 and there is your go oh no not adhesive tabs good night miss mari thank you for coming and spending time with us okay no worries just uh skip to the end to the rewatch uh and do that Sandy, you want some of that? Gotcha. <laughs> Your cat flock is on else. Nobody else for the pink? Okay. That is okay. Moving on. We have some of these. Uh, uh. This is that blotter paper that I showed you before. So you get uh, how many did I say this was? I'm okay. So it's five five pieces. Um, they all have the same. I think they're all the same for this this floral design. Yeah, like a basket of it's a basket with a plant in it and a. Um, so it is a blotter paper for a desk, and it's got the perpetual calendar here. Um, there are four of these, five pieces for 50 cents. <laughs> She's a sweet lady. Uh, so five pack. Okay. And then a spell calendar, 50 cents. Don't judge me for my spelling. Got Roseanne for one of those. Okay, three still available. Next up is going to be uh, signature pages. I. I had some uh, their thrift store finds, wide rule uh, composition books. Dyed a nice light pink, so uh, five signature pages from the composition book. Uh, Fifty cents. 
And there are six of these available. Five cast signature. And there is your go. Roseanne, two for you. Okay. Next up is the large lunch set. There are three of these available, and they're going to be 50 cents each. There we go. And there's the inside, in case you were wondering. <laughs> so only three. Uh, each one is 50 cents. So let's go ahead. Uh, one large cent. And the go is coming your way. Oh. Message of some kind. Okay, nobody for lunch sacks. Up next are uh this is a five pack. It is a signature page, so like this. And it's got like uh, a couple of like postmarks. And this is a stamp. And then there's this uh, black and white design at the top. So there's two of these five packs signature. Roseanne, you'd like three of those? Uh, all three of the lunch sacks? Gotcha. Oh, and one for J-Mac. So Roseanne, well, Roseanne times two and one for J-Mac. No worries. So uh, when you fold it, the pages are five and three quarters by seven and three quarters. And um, these are also 50 cents. Okay, gotcha. So, J-Mac, you get one, and Roseanne's having two of those lunch sacks. Um, drawing pieces. Uh, signature. Uh, pages with black and white design. 50 cents, and the go is coming your way. Oh, you're going to pay? Okay. No worries. Gifted. You guys are sweet. Okay, Els will take all of those. All two of them. Gotcha. You can come in and snatch those if you want. All right, next up is lined paper. This is standard notebook paper college rule. There are five 10 packs and one 25 pack. So the five packs are uh, $3.50 and the 25 pack is $8. We'll do the 10 packs first as usual. Not very many markings or other, uh, no over dyeing or anything. So we'll start with these 10 packs. Nice light pink, uh, $3.50 for a pack. Uh, 10 packs. You know what? I think this is wrong. Um, I think it's six, and I think it's two fifty. I'm pretty sure on the lined paper. So ten pack uh, lined notebook, pink, pink lined notebook, uh, two fifty. And there is your go. And then I'll put the twenty five pack in uh, after that. I'm 
trying to get a drink for a second right here. Okay, no interest. We'll try the 25 pack, probably the same, no worries. And there's the go. And there's only one of the 25 packs. Okay. Uh, 10 pack pale pink newsprint. This is the first grade paper. And I don't know why, because this is super light dyed, but the lines are not. I can see them very, very faintly in the background. I think maybe the line is blending with the pink. I don't know. It's hard to see the lines. I'm going to say that. So, uh, you think it would be easy on this one, but it's not. 10 pack pale pink uh, newsprint, first grade. Well, $1.75. And there's your go. Okay. Roseanne, you'll take one of those. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. While well, you guys are deciding if you need it or not, we have uh, the 110 pound cardstock here for the pink. A few occlusions with the color, uh, with the white spots. Only a few pages have that. And I think it's only one. Like there's one here and a small one there. Um, pretty evenly colored. 110 pound cardstock. Five pack for $1.75. Oh, and I've got Bima for one of those uh, newsprints. Okay, so five pack. 67, no, 110. I'm smoking crack. 110 pound card. Pink, uh, 175, and there is your go. Okay, no worries. I won't sign you up for the. I'll get you for the cardstock. And one for JMAC. Gotcha. Thank you. Thank you, ladies. We're up to dot matrix paper. We have five tens and one twenty-five. Um, this is where we're starting to see some over dyeing. These papers were closer to the bottom. And so that's this. Um, it is a pink on pink thing. But when the pink separates and there's more dye than the paper can uh, absorb, it rests on and it does almost take on a blush or a even sometimes uh, it looks slightly brown, but it's not. It is a pink on pink. Uh, it's just dye that rests on the paper. So you can see some like that. So these have a little more patterning and it has nothing to do with the drying process. That's just dye. Uh, laying in between the papers that didn't absorb. So we're going to do the 10 packs as usual. And then the 25 pack. Four on the 10s. And uh, 10 on the 25. <laughs> yes, Carla. Perhaps you should. Could be done if we visited a dermatologist. So 10 pack. 20 pound dot matrix. And there is your go on the 10 packs. And then we'll put in the 25 pack. Uh-oh. Got Roseanne for one of those. 
And there is the 25 if anybody's interested. Okay. We're down to our last couple items here. We've got this and the ledger paper, and that's, that'll be the end. And then we'll do the giveaway and the recap. You are a mean, mean lady. I'm going to remember this one is time for your sale. All right, so what we have here, this is our 24-pound paper. It does have the over-dyeing. Um, there are six of the... Oh, no, I'm over here. There are eight of the 10 packs and five of the 25 packs. And I'm just going to kind of do a, I'm going to, I'm going to take less than this. I'm going to leave a couple here. They're all fairly similar. Let's see here. Oop, and that one's bent over. It happens. So you can start to see some of the over dyeing. It's a medium tone pink is how it came out this time. Um, I think it's kind of almost a fleshy tone. It's not peach, but it's not like a pale, pale pink. Although there are a few pages throughout that do are a little bit paler. Um, so this is almost like a flesh tone for me. So there we go. There are a few occlusions in here as well. Um... There may be one or two pieces that are, uh, like this one has a little tear in it. It does happen. And some of them escape the process, you know. So I will do the 10 packs first. And then the 25 packs. Um, and no worries if there's not much interest. I know pink's not for everybody. Lobster in baked potato. <laughs> you had beef. Oh, noodles like those. I bet. Bima did not share with Harry. So we're going to start with the 10 packs. Pink, 24 pound with markings. Those are $4. There you go. And then the 25 packs will be 10. Okay. I saw Roseanne pop up there. She's obviously a pink lover. Sandra would like a pack. And I'm making her name starting with a straight line. I don't know why. I'm going to give you a dollar sign in your name. That's what it is. My son picked it. Oh, nice. Happy birthday, Leanne. Happy, happy birthday to you. You know what that means, right? Birthday girl, you get a 10% discount. I got to write that down somewhere. <laughs> Let me put it in the uh, giveaway section. I'll do it down here. Leah. 10% discount birthday girl. You turned the big 5-0. Oh, I'm 5-3. I turned 5-3 on the third, on the second. I don't even know when my birthday is. Happy, happy birthday. And we'll get you a, a, a discount on everything you order, lady. There's the 25 pack. <laughs> if anybody's interested. But get in your happy birthdays because 50 is a milestone. You're just a baby. <laughs> I'm 53, Els is 54, and San Sandra is 55. She finally hit the big... Five five. <laughs> you leveling up. You leveling up. All right. So are we all done with the pink, ladies? You've had enough with the pink. All right. Now I got to find my phone. I got to find a random number generator for the giveaway. All right, let me figure out what I did with it. All right, I am giving away one, two, three packs of apple green, three 10 packs of apple green paper for three lucky winners today.
Okay, no, no paper for Sandy. <laughs> I earned every one of my years and all my gray hairs. I'm proud of them. So uh, let's see how many people are in the room. Let me take a peek. See, says there are 18 of you. Wow, that's pretty good. Woo -woo. So we'll do a number between 1 and 35. So that gives you guys wiggle. We're not all packed together. Number between 1 and 35. There you go. This is our light green. Uh, the uh, goth rainbow will have olive green. You're self-policing. If you've got a duplicate number, please make sure the second person who puts it in changes their number. I don't see any duplicates yet, but it does happen. Now, let me get a random number generator. I'm all babbling away and not doing what I'm supposed to do. Look at me. I've got 17, 27, 21, 4, 22, 18, 9, 30, and 20. Okay. Let's do... Random number generator. Between 1 and 35. All right, is everybody in there? Okay, let's see if we can get this on camera now. Hold the phone, please. I got to make sure I'm live so I can see if you can see that. Okay. So, oh, I can't see it at all. That's awesome. Let me move that away. Okay. So, I haven't pushed the button yet. So we're going to do it three shit. Nope, that's not it. Hold, please. That's my alarm. Okay, here we go. Sorry. Oh, phones. Okay. Uh, all right, so here we go. 20. <laughs> Rosemary. <laughs> okay. Let me get over here. Okay. So we're going to draw another number. Can only win once. 19. Anybody at 19? Closest would be Carla. Woo, Carla. And let's hope it doesn't give us 35. Well, now, so did anybody guess 35? Oh, uh, closest without going over is Francis. Woo, Francis. Okay, those are our three winners. Look at you guys. So let me write your names on here. We've got Rosemary, Carla, and Francis. There we go. Congratulations, ladies. All right, we will be doing the recap. If you are all done and you don't need the recap, I want to thank you guys for coming in and spending time with me. Billing will be happening starting tomorrow afternoon. I am not billing tonight. I am exhausted. Only the Lord knows what would happen with your bills if I tried to do them tonight. <laughs> no joke. Um, so here we are. Um, so, yeah, if you uh, are leaving us, I thank you for coming in. I hope you have a great rest of your weekend. Don't forget, Els is having her sale at 4 p.m. our time tomorrow. Rosemary, happy dance. <laughs> you like the apple green? Um, uh, so that's 4 p.m. here. That's 5, 6, and 7 across the country. And she's got some fun stuff. She's got some stuff I'm a little bit lusty after, but I'm going to have to keep myself under control. I got things I got to do. Good night, Danielle. Thanks for um, coming in. Have some great sleep. And enjoy your Sunday, lady.
I got to do the recap. I promised. <laughs> so, um, this is our five pack of uh, Winter Delights, which is gray with sparkle. Or anything that says with sparkle may or may not have sparkle. We're phasing out the sparkle in coffee filters. So future sets will not have any sparkle, but some of these current sets will have a few pieces with sparkle in them. So gray with sparkle, Bemis blue, tentative dawn, a very light olive green, and a lavender with sparkle. So it's five colors, five pieces each color, 25 pieces, and that is $2. There are three available. At this point, I'm not doing goes. If you want it, you say coffee filters me and I will give it to you. And just that kind of thing for every item we come up to. Uh, oh, please. Okay. We have uh, still two available. Our creamsicle paper, which is the tea dye paper with the orange over dye. There are two of these available and they are $3 per pack. J-Mac, you'd like the coffee filters? Gotcha. There's still one left if anybody's interested. Ooh, night swim, huh? Hold on. I got to write this stuff down. Hold, please. Night swim. And Lisa Frankenstein. Are you kidding me? easily distracted did you get one of what the coffee filters um yes yes you did sandy you got it before okay so uh one creamsicle paper left and i'm moving on to the next thing uh okay there is one two two left of The quote-unquote dirty coffee dyed paper. It's um, not all of them have this level of. Some of them are just uh, this. Is, these are lighter with markings, but there are some that are um, just like a medium tone, uh, and with just like shading, I guess, and some um, marks. So there are two of these available of the cough of the tea dyed coffee dyed. Coffee dyed 24 pound paper, $3. There are two still available. Okay. Uh, variety planner pictures. Okay. So there is two. There are. Those look gorgeous. Me at two. Uh, is that for the coffee dyed paper? J Mac, did you get these already? You got the coffee dyed paper. You bought a pack of the of the coffee dyed and in the cream sickle. Yes, you got one. Coffee. Okay, so you for the last two. Gotcha. All right. So this is a multi-pack, uh, 14 pieces. One of these, uh, kind of red ones. There are two of these. Uh, it's like a gray kind of color in there. Uh, and same on the back. One of these to do's five of these kind of liney ones here. And then there are five of these tiny, uh, it doesn't show very well, but it is, uh, like 10 squares per inch grid paper. On one side, the black back side of this is blank, and on the other side of the line, once it's still lined, so it's fourteen pieces, and it is two fifty, and there are two left. Ah. Uh. Oh, please. There it 
I knew you were hiding in there. Okay. No takers on the 14 pack. Okay. Um, we have two, three. We have three left of these. Yes, I know guac is extra, but so am I. These are newsprint. They're little cheapy ones. They're 25 cents for a five pack. And there are one, two, three available. Uh, eight piece for this pack. Francis, you like the guac is extra one of those? Gotcha. All right, there is one left of these uh, Atlas Roadmap pages. This is uh, 82 or 84, I can't remember. Um, and I tore them out of the book. This is what I use for my desk cleanup. So if you've watched any of those videos, you've seen that. There's one pack of these left, eight pages. It's $1.25 for a pack. Rosemary, you'll take that. Gotcha. Rosemary M. I tried to make you Rosemary Peacock. <laughs> okay, all of the uh, file folders sold. Okay. Okay, um, there is a 25 pack of the Dot Matrix. 20 pound paper available. It is $8. It is uh, minor markings and it is a lighter paper. Uh, tea dyed. I'm sorry. I said coffee, but this is tea dyed. So 25 sheets, $8 of the dot matrix. There's one of those available. You'll take the dot, Rosemary. Awesome. Yep, totally trying to change Rosemary's last name from Morris to Peacock. <laughs> oh, that's a cute idea, Carla. Okay, there is one of these available. Um, the seventies memo papers. Uh, this is a five pack, um, 50 cents. All right. She may not be watching anymore. Sometimes she takes off on us. She is who she is. Nine died. Okay. There were still some of the, well, The non-dyed, so these are the mostly religious uh, um, uh, friendship quotes. Uh, Optimism is, is, is the truth that leads to achievement. Nothing can be done without hope and confidence. This was kind of uplifting friendship uh, kind of quotes. Not all of them are, here's Proverbs uh, 15, 13. Uh, a happy heart makes a face cheerful. There are still two packs of these available. I think. Hold on. Undyed. Where'd we go? Yeah, two of these available, 75 cents. If anybody is interested. Okay. Sandra, did you want uh, the memo pad or the quotes? Let me know. All right, quotes. Uh, we have two left of the 45-piece uh, grab bag. Um, so there are two. These are the... Uh, I'll just pull it out. So we'll start from the back on this. Quotes. Okay, so you take one of those quotes. Gotcha, Sandy. One left on that. 
So there are two of, so this is a 45 piece grab bag, uh, six fifty. There are two left. So there's two of these. Let me move this stuff so I don't get anything confused with anything else. We'll be shoving stuff in the bag. I'll be like, why don't I have enough? Okay. So two of those, uh, column or papers. Um, uh, then there's, uh, two, three of these. Um, all the packs are similar. There may be slightly more or slightly less of certain things, but in general, they are the same. Two of the dot matrixes. Uh, this one has, each one has a map piece of some sort. This one has, uh, the Lake Mead scenic drive map from when we went to Lake Mead. This one is the only one with a piece of vellum in it. No cherry picking or requesting. These are going to be drawn at random so that nobody thinks I'm uh, so three sheets of regular coffee for one of that. These are the hard line, the ones that are at the front and back of when I make the creamsicle paper. So they have uh, the harshest line on them. So three of those. Then, uh, oh, here we go. Okay, so this is, uh, there are no more than two of each pattern. It's all green. So we've got the checks, the stripes the polka dotties and then the other polka dotties there's one of this one there's one two of the nine there's several two of the nine by nine parchments some of the packs only have one there's one or two of these maps in there there are some half sheets of paper right here this is the inside from a uh a book you know the page before all the pages i can't think of the name of it one of those there are five of these they're the single sheets from the um, the pink one you saw, a doily, a, this is the only one that has that. And then there are some small pieces in here, tickets, listy things, some receipts. Each one has a glassine bag. There are some uh, non-lined index cards in here. And then there, each one I think has one of these uh, small map pages. A couple of them have some guest checks in them. So it's 45 pieces. It's actually like 46 or 47. Um, but to be safe, I said 45. So uh, that's the grab bag, 650. And there are two of those available. End papers. Yeah, there you go. CD envelope. Yeah. I'm losing the words. So there are two of those available. Okay. Um, so there are uh, There's one of these left. This is the line paper that has the line, the gap, and then a longer line. Um, remember the black, the backs were blank. There was some transfer. So the backs are now lined, but it's wonky. It's however the paper's laid on top of one another. Some occlusions and a little bit of markings. Uh, that's $4, and there's one of those available. Uh, Francis, you'll take a grab bag. Okay. Lovely. There's one still available. Gotcha. There is definitely enough in that kit to make a journal. The pages just wouldn't all be the same size, you know. And supplementing with yourself, you could probably make a couple of journals out of what's in that bag. Uh, you just need your own cover. Probably a file folder or something. <laughs> Okay, so uh, one of those lined orange papers. Uh, we have one, two, three, four, five of the coral sandwich wrap. Which is this right here. So coral sandwich wrap. Five of those at $250. Uh, orange placemats. So these are uh, 10 by 14 embossed placemats. They're uh, five packs for $1.75. There are three, four, five, six, seven, eight available. 
And then uh, there is the uh, 10 pack of coral. It's newsprint type paper, but it's got the um, uh, four squares per inch. It's either four or five squares per inch uh, grid paper. That's $1.75, three of those available. Of the darker, regular newsprint paper uh, with the lines are very hard to see. Um, this is also $1.75 and there are one, two, three, four of those available. Did you get placemats, Roseanne? No, did you want some, Roseanne? Uh, yes, they would. Janice, you want the grid? Gotcha. Oh, you already got one, hon. Do you want a second one? Or are you good with just the one you got? Yeah, it does. Okay, so second one for Janice. <laughs> you don't have to commit if you said it and you've already got it, you know. Rosemary had two, so there's one left. Uh, placemats, two for Rosemary. Yeah, I have, uh, on the placemats, I have plenty. Rosemary times two, so Roseanne times one. And one, two, three, there are five left. <laughs> no worries. There's plenty. Plenty of the placemats. And then uh, the darker newsprint, one, two, four, five, $1.75 on that. Next up, we have the 110 pound cardstock, a five pack for a dollar fifty. We have uh, two of the 10 packs of the Coral Dot Matrix, 20 pound paper at $4. Okay. Uh, we got down here into the... Hold on a minute. Okay, so the coral with stippling on it, we have one, two, ten packs at four dollars and two twenty-five packs at ten. And then uh, the plain coral with uh, it's, you know, it has a few occlusions and the line, the markings where a paper laid on top of other paper, but it doesn't have the stippling. Uh, that is, again, it's four and ten. We have two of the ten packs and uh, two of the twenty-five packs available there. So, and then on uh, the eleven by seventeen paper for the coral, we have one, two, three, four for three dollars left. Eleven by seventeen coral times two. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Palm folders are gone. Okay, then we're now we're down to the pink. Of the sandwich wrap, I have one, two, three, four, five. Uh plus seven is twelve. There are twelve of the sandwich wraps for two fifty. Let's see. Hold on while I move some stuff around real quick.
Whoa, whoa, no, you don't. Okay. So there are three of these available. It's the blotter paper with the floral thing on it. That is 50 cents. Three of those available. Uh, signature uh, wide rule composition uh, pages. Five pack, 50 cents. Out. Okay. Hold a moment, please. So we've got a lined notebook paper. Uh, it's two fifty for a ten pack, and I have five, and it's six dollars for a twenty five pack. I have one. On the uh, newsprint paper, it's a dollar seventy-five, and there are one, two, three, four, five available. On the hundred and ten-pound cardstock in the pink, one, two, three, four, five available for a dollar seventy-five. Um, on the uh, dot matrix paper. I have uh, four 10 packs at $4 and one 25 pack at 10. Uh, pink with markings. So that's the uh, paper with, uh, that's the dot matrix. So uh, dot matrix, uh, four of the 10s at four and one of the 25s. And then uh, we have a, uh, the pink with the markings, uh, 10 packs, we have one, two, three, four, five. 25 packs, we have five. 10 packs are four, the 25 packs are 10. And last, uh, I think the last available item, yeah, is the uh, 20 pound 11 by 17 in the pink. We have uh, six of the light and three of the darker. Uh, they're not terribly darker. You'll have one newsprint, Francis. Okay, Francis. Okay. All right, and that's everything. That's everything we got. Let me go back here real quick and just check one thing. Okay. Every, that's everything. I thought I had one more item, but I to the pastel. It's not pastel. It's <laughs> goth rainbow. Goth rainbow. I think you might already be on the list. I gotta. It's on it. It's in another pad. I'm gonna and I'll uh, go into the group and all. Francis. I'm pretty sure you're on the list, Francis. And I'll verify everybody on it. One light pink large paper for Janice. Okay. Uh, okay, gotcha. All right. I think I got everybody. If you guys are all good, we're ready to be done. And I thank you guys for coming in and spending time with me on this fine Saturday night when you had many, many choices of things to do. <laughs> I appreciate your time. And uh, also, you know, for people who ordered, awesome, fantastic. But you don't have to buy things to uh, be in here. So I appreciate you guys that came in and hung out. You're awesome, too. <laughs> However you guys are spending your days and nights, I hope it brings you great joy and happiness. Each and every one of you absolutely deserves it. Until I see you in one of my lives or in a box somewhere, I wish you guys the happiest of camp, of crafting, not camping, or camping and crafting, whatever floats your boat. <laughs> bye, 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 bye. And that's going to be the end for us tonight, ladies. You are beyond awesome. Bright blessings and hugs and hisses to you all. Good night, ladies, or have fun if you're staying up. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, you are so welcome, J-Mac. Thanks for coming in. Night-night. The end. I pushed a button. I pushed a button. <laughs>